Hey guys, it's your girl Nicola, and I am back with another video and you probably see something so different about me. It is my hair! And this is really, really drastic for me, but I enjoy it. So if you guys want to know some more information about my hair, stay tuned because I'm going to tell you some stuff. I know you want to know some stuff. Just kidding. Just keep watching and I'll let you know. G M K Hey guys, it's your girl Nicola and I'm back and as I said in the intro, this video is all about my hair. I'm so excited to finally be sharing it with you because I have been so reluctant to post pictures on Instagram, Facebook, or any social media that. Um, let's just get started. I decided one morning that I wanted something very, very different. I know you guys see Zara and I always with our Senegalese twists that are silver. And I was like, no, I want something that's completely silver. So I came to Zara, I was like, what do you think of a silver bob? And she said, do it. And that's exactly what I did. I have crochet braids. And this is the silver hair that I typically use in my Senegalese twists. So I'll just, you know, let you guys soak it in. <laughs> but yeah, I've been loving it. It's so awesome. I got it done by Edwidge Condombo. You know, my favorite hairdresser. That's who does Zara's hair, Valerie's hair. She's like our hairstylist of life, basically. We love her. We constantly recommend anyone to go to her if you are in the DMV area or if you want to make the trip, just come on down to Maryland and go to her. Um, once again, it is crochet braids. I used six and a half packs, I believe. I was about to try and fit seven, but it just couldn't work. I really like it because even with six and a half, it's very, very full to me. And I thought that this like shoulder length bob style would be ideal because I didn't want something too long. I was kind of getting really tired of the extremely long Senegalese twist that I constantly had that you guys see. They were just getting a little bit too heavy for me, so I wanted something light, airy, and fun. And I think this is just so fun, sophisticated at the same time, and I have been wearing it for, I think, a good week and a half to two weeks now, and I've gotten countless compliments, and I am so happy with the hair. I will definitely leave Miss Edwidge's information in the description box down below because this hair is just amazing. So if you guys want any more information like on how to do a wash and go, well not a wash and go, just on how to wash this crochet braids because yes, you can wash your crochet braids. Zara and I will be coming back with another video for you. And if you want another video on how to even curl the hair to maintain the curls or how I sleep with it at night, just comment down below. Before I go, you guys, I want you to do three more things than just comment. One, subscribe to our channel. That is how you can keep up with my journey on this hair. <laughs> Two, don't forget to like this video if you like videos like this. I know, that's a ton of likes, but just like the video. Don't forget, last but not least, share with your friends, share with your family. You never know, this style might inspire someone. Right? Jokes. All right, guys, I'll catch you in my next video. Thank you for allowing me to give my hair its little debut. All right, bye you guys, mutual love.